welcome back to my channel today I'm going to be doing 10 nail hacks that you've never seen before part 2 I posted a 10 nail art hacks you've never seen before part 1 about a few days ago and you guys seem to have loved it I received so many requests to do a part 2 so if you haven't seen the first video I'm going to be putting the link in the description box or like somewhere over here that you can click so yeah guys let's move on here are 10 nail hacks that you've never seen before part 2 First hack, how to make your own DIY nail polish remover wipes in a matter of seconds. Just soak some cotton pads with nail polish remover. Then place your cotton pads in a sandwich Ziploc bag. Make sure to squeeze out all the air before you lock it. I usually bring a backpack or handbag when I fly, so I always hesitate to travel with extra things like polish remover, but then I end up regretting it when my nails look terrible by the end of the trip. So these DIY remover pads will save you a lot of headaches. Next hack, when there is not a single drop of nail polish remover around you, you could totally use perfume to remove your polish. Just spritz some perfume on a cotton ball and wipe away. Perfumes contain ethyl acetate which is a key ingredient in most polish removers. Here's yet another way to remove nail polish when you don't have remover, this time using toothpaste. Squeeze some toothpaste on a cotton ball and wipe the nail polish away. Let me just say this is quite messy and it obviously does not come off as fast as a remover but it does a job and this is great for those many times when you're traveling and you're out of remover. Next hack, use hairspray to dry your nails fast. After you painted your nails, spray from 6 to 8 inches away so the polish will set right. The alcohol and hairspray will help your nails dry quickly. To prevent the tips of your painted nails from chipping, use this next nail hack and paint two base coat layers. Select your favorite base coat and paint one coat on the top half of your nail and then a second coat over the entire nail. And make sure to not skip the edge of your nail, this will ensure your entire nail is sealed. Here's another trick to make your manicure last as long as it can. Reapply a layer of clear top coat every two days to prevent chipping and enhance shine. Next hack, here's a really simple remedy that boosts nail growth, which is orange juice. The vitamin C encourages the production of collagen and keeps your nails healthy. Also, it has folic acid, which is essential for nail growth. Soak your nails in fresh orange juice for at least 10 minutes and then rinse it off. Follow this remedy until you are satisfied with the results. If you only moisturize your nail and the cuticle, then you're ignoring the most important part. See the area between your cuticle and first knuckle? That's actually where your nail starts growing. This area is known as the nail matrix. Next time, take your cuticle oil all the way down to your second knuckle to really reap all the benefits when moisturizing. A way to do that is by doing a DIY nail mask. Cut medium-sized pieces of paper towels and soak them in coconut oil. By the way, you could use other oils or combinations, whatever you want. I'm just using coconut oil because that's my favorite. Wrap it around your nail and cut the excess paper. Now you want the oil wrap to stay in place so cut off the finger parts from an old dishwashing glove and put them on individually or if you'd like you could just put the glove on as is without cutting it. I personally just like it this way. Leave them on for 15 to 30 minutes. This will repair dry cuticles, strengthen and whiten your nails. So many benefits. Do this twice a month and I promise you will see a difference. Next hack, create an intricate detailed nail art design using a fine point sharpie or you could use gel pens which a lot of nail artists use and rave about but not many people know this but it really doesn't get any easier than this. It's so useful when you want to make thin lines but rather not use a normal brush which is so difficult to do. By the way, if you use the sharpie, make sure to lightly apply hairspray and then seal it in with a top coat. last hack use a nail mat to practice on your nail art I designed a DIY nail art mat for you guys if you're interested print it out then insert it in a clear pocket or a gallon ziplock bag as you can see I've made a little section where you can make your own customized nail stickers and it's extremely easy just dip a toothpick and polish and then go over the symbol of your choice I've included many different symbols I even have Halloween ones um, on there since that's around the corner when you're done add a coat of polish on top and let it dry Peel it off from your mat and apply it to your nail. Really easy way to make DIY nail art stickers. You could even freestyle it and just make any shape or symbol you'd like. It's really cool. So if you're interested in getting your own, I'll be putting the link in the description box. So definitely check that out. I hope you guys like it.
So yeah guys, those were 10 nail hacks that you've never seen before. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. Of course, let me know which one was your favorite. Also, before I move on with the video, I want to take the time to thank each and every one of you that's been leaving me so many nice comments and just, you know, just supporting me. You don't know how much one comment makes my day. Even if it's just, if you don't understand it, it really makes my day, you have no idea. I get excited when I even get one comment. Like it's just, yeah, it just makes my day. So I just wanted to say thank you. If you have any video requests, leave them in the comments below. I always read my comments. So yeah, don't hesitate to leave your request in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video.